So I'm an electrical network asset engineer. Um, I'm responsible for looking after and maintaining our wastewater pumping stations in our network. I find it so fascinating how different every day is and how challenging it can be. I love how challenging it can be. Um, I love how you've got to come up with innovative ways of thinking to solve problems. I've got quite a few um, highlights in my career. I was nominated Top 50 Future List for Northern Power Women Awards last year. Um, I got to go to Manchester in the Hilton. I got, also got to present an award as well. It was absolutely fascinating. I really enjoyed meeting you know, other women um, in business. When I was in school, um, I loved cars and I wanted to be a mechanic at first. And like I spoke to my dad and I was like, oh dad, I really want to go into mechanics. And he's like, what about engineering? Like, you know, you, you love physics, you're good at it, you're good at maths, why don't you do engineering? I think there are very few women because first off, it's a male dominated career choice at the moment. I think women are put off by that because they think, they doubt themselves that they can't do as a good job as a man when they can. And I think women also put off because they think it's a dirty job and it's not glamorous, but really you can be an engineer who's office based or you can be field based. There's so many engineering roles, so you know, if you don't necessarily want to get your hands dirty, you don't have to. Some advice for women wanting to go into engineering is um, stay motivated, work hard and get your GCSEs. Um, never doubt yourself always stay confident and if you do doubt yourself there's always going to be support um, and also it's not just for men.